Welcome to another Business Tech Planet video. Today, we'll show you how to fix the 8018 0002 error in Azure. First, we'll talk briefly about what the error means. Then we'll show you how to disable any problematic access policies. And finally, we'll show you how to solve the problem by disabling MDM and MAM. You might encounter the 8018 0002 error when adding user access to Azure. The server message will likely inform you that the server failed to authenticate the user. Please note that you will need admin permissions to resolve this problem. If the problem is being caused by a conditional access policy, you can change or disable it in the Azure Admin Center. Start by opening your Admin Center and clicking the menu icon in the top left. Then go down and click Azure Active Directory. If you can't see Azure, click Show All at the bottom. Next, click on Protect and Secure in the left menu. Then select Conditional Access from the revealed options. If you have a policy that might be causing the error, click the policy name. Then modify the policy or disable it by selecting Off at the bottom. Hit Save to finish. If the error persists, try the next solution. Because Mobile Device Management, or MDM, is used to enroll users into Intune, you could try turning it off in your Azure Admin Center. To do that, open Azure as described in the previous solution, and click the search bar at the top. Now enter MDM. Then select Mobility MDM and MAM from the results. Click on Microsoft Intune. Next, you want to set MDM and MAM to None. And finally hit Save at the top. If you still see the 8018002 error, then please drop us a comment and we'll do our best to get back to you. That's all for this video. We hope it was helpful. Check the description for additional links and resources. And leave a comment below if you have any concerns or questions. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe for more Microsoft videos.